内野ならどこでもこなせる守備の名手であるミゲル・ロハス選手今季からショートに入っているベッツ選手に守備のレクチャーをしていたのが印象的ですそんなミゲル・ロハス選手が JM ベースボールの番組に出演し今季チームメイトになった大谷選手のバッティングの能力についてコメントしていました Offense, you get a great look at it every night. Sometimes you are a part of it.、Uh, the first five hitters in the lineup are certifiably insane in the sort of numbers they're putting on. I want you to,、um, this is from the broadcast against the Marlins. It was either Monday or Tuesday night. This is Shohei's home run. I want you to listen to it, and then we'll talk about it. He hit a line drive to second base, and it's 106 miles per hour. And it sounded like a shotgun. You know? The other day, like, I mean, Mook is terrifying. He's running at first base a lot of the times that Mook is, that, that show is hitting, right? He's taking his secondary lead backwards because he's afraid to get hit. <laughs> If I get hit with one of these 111, 118 mile per hour line drive, he's out, you know? So, That's the kind of, that's kind of、um, greatness that we're watching every single day. It's not just the homers. I mean, yeah, the homers are going to make it to the, to the highlight reel. But the thing is, like, on an everyday basis, he's hitting balls out of five bats per day, at least three balls at over 110 miles per hour. It's crazy. It's unbelievable how he can be like, the other day he like, lined out to, to left field. And the first thing that we do is like look up the, of the scoreboard because that ball is 108 miles per hour. And it feels like he just flicked the wrist to the ball. That's how great、um, and how, like, how much better of a, of a player and of an athlete this guy is. And it's really fun that we have in our, in our team. Do you have a lot of conversations with him? Because I know I heard that he speaks pretty good Spanish, actually. No, I haven't, I haven't talked to him in Spanish, but his English is, is, is really good. So he's always,、um, he's always talking、uh, about the pitcher, about the situation of the game,、uh, what kind of pitch he gets, you know, what's the, you know, what, is he, what is he watching from the dugout.、Um, like he's, you know, like I'm not, playing, I'm not playing every single day right now and I'm spending a lot of time by the cage where he sits to watch his at bat.、Um, and kind of you ask him, like, I mean, what he thinks about you know, that pitch or whatever. And sometimes he c o m e back and he s a y、ah, that, that, that change was nasty. Or this pitch,、um, the fastball was running this way. So I, against the lefty the other day, last, last day I played, he came to the dugout, he strike out in the first at bat, and he came to me and s a y hey, his fastball is, is running. You know, like he, he actually g i v e you feedback from, from his at bat, even when he's not succeeding, and he's, he's helping you. To actually have a better understanding because he's hitting at the top of the lineup. I mean, listen, you've, you've seen him from afar. You've competed against him since he came into baseball in 2018. But now that you get to see him on a daily basis, what is it that surprises you most about his ability? Oh, the ability to swing the bat as fast as he is, you know. I remember early in the year, he was having trouble. Like, he, he didn't have a homer, like, for, I mean, I don't know, the first two weeks of the season or something like that.、Um, he was like, 40 or 50 at bats in, in, into his season, and he don't have, have a homer. I feel like he was like trying to swing faster, you know, because he kind of you know, wants to like kind of have a bat speed so he、mm -hmm. can hit the ball far. But for like, he's a guy who, who doesn't need extra bat speed, he already has some. So for me, it's the ability to swing the bat like on a like everybody swing the bat like 80%. His 80% is like 125% of us, you know? So it's, it's crazy how when he turned it down a little bit, he still swings the bat really fast, he still hits it really hard, and he doesn't have to like use all his energy. So that's why this guy is able to do both, you know? When he started pitching again, he's gonna be able to do both. He's gonna be able to pitch and to swing because he doesn't need 100% of his energy every single time that he swings the bat, you know? So he can go 60%. And he still can, can hit balls out opposite field, center field, right field, compared to us, the regular player who needs like 100%, the perfect, perfect on MLB the show for us to hit a home run the way he hit it, you know? 
You mean just you regular humans or whatever? Regular Instead humans. Instead of whatever planet he's from, because he's not from this one. Yeah, he's definitely the GOAT. He's, I, I already, like, you, um, Austin, Martin and, uh, Austin Barnes and I are always in, in awe every time he does something like that, and we call him the unicorn, and we call him the GOAT. He's, he's, he's a GOAT. I, I mean, I've seen, it as, I've seen enough to, to know that this guy is, I mean, the best that uh, ever do it. ラックス選手の控え足としてベンチにいる機会が多いため、大谷選手と会話をすることも多くコミュニケーションもしっかりとっていることも伝わってきました。やはりあのスイングから繰り出す打球速度について驚く。